With the mobile market penetrating every aspect of our lives, there is hardly anyone left untouched. While everyone wants to keep up with the latest handset available in the market, the question is, what happens to the old used gadgets? This is the problem that Budley.in is aiming to solve. I'm fond of using the latest gadgets. A couple of years back, I upgraded to a new phone. I was wondering, what do I do with my old phone? I looked at various models that were available to me. One is I could uh, give it to a local dealer, but the pricing is very inconsistent. Or I could sell it to an online classified ad site, where I could list a product, but I wasn't sure when it will sell, at what price. I wasn't sure of the generator of the person who's going to buy from me. Or else the last option was it will end up in a drawer somewhere in my house losing value. It will end up becoming e-waste. So I looked at solving the problem, what do we do with our used gadgets? Budli, which started in Kolkata in 2013, moved to Bangalore a few months ago and now the eight-member team operates from here. It runs on a simple business model. The old gadgets are bought back from the customer, refurbished and resold with a warranty. Now we're looking at uh, solving the problem, what do we do, do with our used gadgets? We are buying back from consumers online, we also buy back e-commerce returns and we buy back from companies as well. These products are then, uh, it goes through a 25-point QC uh, and then it goes through a refurbishment and then the certified pre-owned gadgets are resold with warranty both online and offline. The company which is currently bootstrapped is looking to raise its first round of funding soon. The founder has a vision to bridge the digital divide in India through re-commerce. Uh, this is a very exciting space. This is an emerging space. So there are a number of companies which are now coming up trying to solve this problem in one way or the other. Our business model is unique. Uh, there are different people looking at solving this problem in different ways. Uh, and we are looking at it uh, from a larger perspective and a longer term perspective. We are looking at solving the problem for the consumers. What do we do with our used gadgets? And then uh, for people who want to buy certified pre-owned gadgets, from a trusted source with an assurance of a warranty. So we're looking at uh, taking ownership of solving these two problems. With companies like Budli taking the lead in solving the problems of used gadgets, looks like re-commerce will be the next big thing. In the recent global startup ecosystem ranking, Bengaluru is ranked at number 15 and Kormangla specifically is the crucible for this startup explosion. Grofers raised $46.5 million from existing funders and the valuation of the company is around $115 million.